Hail to the Emperor! More importantly, hail to you, Master. So what's the story, Sith? Seems like you know all about me, and I don't know nothing about you. You always a sicko, or did you just kind of fall into it like I did? Power is wasted if you don't use it. And I'm not squeamish. We're gonna have a lot of fun together, huh? I was an accountant on Moneyland when I decided I wanted a little more adventure. <laughs> So I put a blaster to the head of the intergalactic banking clan and walked off with a few million credits. Been robbing and murdering ever since. Well, it sounds like you made a good start. Just don't put a blaster to my head. Don't worry, Sith. I've got a good survival instinct. You know, you got a pretty nice ship. It's no Sky Princess, but hey, what is? I had a ship like it once. No armor to speak of, but you don't need defense when you can maneuver like that. You didn't seem to have a ship when I met you. Yeah, got blown to pieces. But it was a thrill while it lasted. Nothing like playing chicken with a ship twice your size and then firing up his tail when he blinks. Sky Princess was great, but she couldn't do that. So why did you move on to the Sky Princess? Nice as a little ship like that is, you just can't carry enough cargo. And you burn too much fuel jumping to hyperspace. Pirate's gotta make a living, and then he's gotta be able to escape when the pressure's on. But this ship here? Huh. Best of both worlds. She'll fly like a dream, and then she'll jump away. I'd be glad to have you as a pilot, if you're half as good as you say you are. My line of work, you don't live long exaggerating. You just tell me where you want to go. Hey, you got time to chat? I didn't think you were the chatting kind. Haven't been aboard too long. Like to know who I'm working with. Nothing touchy-feely, just enough to know you got my back. Good. Because if you got all sensitive on me, I might not like you as much. Last time I cried, I was six years old. The old man shot me in the foot to shut me up. Besides, I've got a reputation to protect. You're a dangerous man. Lucky for you, I like dangerous men. <laughs> Alright, but let's get one thing straight. I'm a pirate, you're a Sith. I'm happy as any guy to give a girl what she wants. But I'm not your slave, right? I'm free to go any time. As long as you don't start getting needy. In that case, I'd have to send you away. Needy? You're thinking of some other guy. Talk to you later, alright? You hear that, Sith? Nothing like it in the galaxy. The hum of an idling blaster. Potential energy right there. It's like waking up on your birthday wondering what you got. For a few minutes, it's anything. A whole galaxy just waiting for you to pull the trigger. What do you call it? Nah, don't name my blasters. It's a bad idea to get attached. Actually, I was wondering. These blasters are nice, but a pirate's only as good as his equipment. We don't got fancy force powers like you Sith. I think I have a spare set here, if that's what you're asking for. I'll pay it back, Sith. Don't worry. Thanks. Hey, I got a surprise for you. Won it a few years ago in a fight against an animid pirate. Called himself the Fear. Kinda crazy, but... Great pilot and a great fighter. Blade's just ornamental, but he sure liked to wave it around. Worth a lot of credits from what I hear. And now you're giving it to me? I'm honored. A beautiful weapon for a beautiful lady. I know you got a lightsaber, but I figured you need something to pretty up the walls around here. If I'm not mistaken, I'd say you have a bit of a romantic streak. Careful what you say. 
but I got a reputation to protect. You know, I think I heard the ship's engine making a strange noise earlier. Mind if I check it out sometime? I didn't know you knew anything about engines. Yeah, I've lived on ships most of my life. You don't do that without picking up something. I'm no expert, but a buddy of mine back before the war taught me most of what I know. Carl Norn, best technician I knew. Worst card player. Could never see when the deck was stacked against him. <laughs> and it always was. You have quite the colorful group of friends. Pirate business has all kinds of people. Made me first mate after the war. On a ship called the Bloodshot Ranker. I learned a lot before he gambled the ship away. But you're sick of hearing me jabber, huh? <sighs> Engine's fixed. Looks like we took on some rock on one of our last jumps. Nothing big. Reminds me of the time I took the Sky Princess through an asteroid field. My ship mechanics were furious. Clean rock out of our engines for weeks. Had to replace one of the rears, it was so badly damaged. What were you doing in an asteroid field? Dodging the enforcers. When you got a fleet of Republic ships on your tail, you take whatever cover you can find. Rocks don't have cannons. <laughs> Besides, what's life without a little risk, huh? That's why I became a pirate. The risk, the reward, the freedom. Perhaps I should take up piracy then. The Sith have too many rules. I think you'd be one of the best. Galaxy's only Sith pirate. You busy? I can think of a number of things we could do. I might have had the same idea. What say we find a quiet spot on the ship? Get to know each other better. Let's find some place quiet then. And dark. I like how you think. Have I ever told you how beautiful you are? No, I don't think you have. Well, you're beautiful. <laughs>